pretty um, satisfying, especially knowing we came pretty close twice before, uh, once in Adelaide and Gaul as well. I think uh, we've spoken about that. Having won six sessions in the game, you usually expect your side to win the game. Um, but I think that game hurt us in the right way, and um, you know, commendable effort by all the boys to regroup themselves after a loss like that. Um, you know, knowing that we should have won the game. Um, I think it's a, it's a tremendous effort, uh, you know, to get yourself together, put in the same kind of practice, and play the same way again, and actually capitalize um, and improve on that particular situation, um, you know, that we failed to in the first test. So that shows that uh, the guys are keen to improve, uh, hungry to win, and I think uh, as a captain, that's very, very satisfying. We will try to stick with this batting order because. फिगर आपको फिगर आउट करना चाहिए कि मतलब कौन उस टाइम पे अच्छा खेल रहा है और कौन वो पोजीशन को अच्छा हैंडल कर सकता है मुझे मुझे अप, अपना एक केस याद है कि जब मैं इतने रन नहीं बना पा रहा था इंग्लैंड टूर के बाद मुझे भी चार नंबर पे पुश किया गया था कि जब सिचुएशन अच्छा होगा और मैं जाऊंगा खेलने और मैं थोड़े रन्स बनाऊंगा तो कॉन्फिडेंस वापस आएगा और फिर मैं वापस तीन पे आ गया तो आई थिंक वो एक प्लेयर के लिए फिगर आउट करना जरूरी है कि कौन उस पोजीशन पे उस स्टेज में बेटर परफॉर्म कर सकेगा वही मैं बात कर रहा हूँ कि जो हमारा फ्लेक्सिबिलिटी है बैटिंग ऑर्डर में वो उसी पे उसी चीज़ के बारे में बात कर रहा था कि जिन क्या पाँच पे भी खेल सकता है छः पे भी खेल सकता है तीन पे भी खेल सकता है हम, हमें पता है रोहित तीन पे भी खेल सकता है पाँच पे भी खेल सकता है दोनों ये लोग टेल के साथ बैटिंग कर सकते हैं तो इतना हमारे वर्सिटैलिटी है बैटिंग ऑर्डर में कि कोई भी किसी भी पोजिशन को टेकअप करने के लिए रेडी है और आई थिंक वैसा माइंड होना ज़रूरी है अगर आपको मैचेस जीतने हैं तो He's been a champion bowler for us. I mean, he's been taking wickets for us everywhere. Even in in the tour of Australia this time around, he was more aggressive with the ball. And uh, you know, he wants to improve on his cricket, and uh, he has certainly done that. Even in his mindset, he's bowling in a more aggressive way now, and uh, it's it's almost looks impossible to get him away. Even for the right-handers, you know, where the ball is spinning into you, uh, should be an easier angle. But even those players, he's he's confusing at the moment. So he's bowling beautifully right now, and. Um, you know really glad to see him in this kind of mindset uh, you know attacking uh, the batsman all the time and bowling attacking lines and lengths and he's obviously a, an asset to have for any team uh, you know a, a spinner of that quality and with that kind of mindset is is uh, a weapon that any any captain would love to have in his in his in his team you know i i want guys to be more expressive i, I want guys to share their ideas with me um you know speak their mind because these are intelligent cricketers if if they are going out there and um you know playing innings creating <clears throat> opportunities for themselves to score runs you know someone like rahul he's young but he's still so mature you know getting those hundreds early on in his career um someone like vijay rohit all these guys know how to build an innings so you need intel intelligence for that and as as batsmen you know um or you can observe another batsman and actually get into his head and know you know what he might be thinking so um it's wonderful to have you know guys contributing uh towards one cause that is winning um and and speaking their mind and actually you know some ideas strike me and i might not be able to think of them because there's so much going on so it's always nice to get all the you know suggestions and then work towards something that will work uh, you know for that particular situation so yeah that's a conscious effort we've made so the guys feel more responsible and more involved in the game throughout rather than you know just saying that okay he he has the responsibility of making the decisions and we'll just field the ball and throw it back it's not that they all all thinking about the game uh, you know with every over that we bowl so which is a, a good thing for the team when i'm padded up at 4 i feel you know these guys when they get a partnership going um you know you feel that belief um in them when you watch them bat and as a batsman sitting outside you actually feel like you know you can be at ease because these guys know what they're doing uh, so that that kind of um, you know faith that they are uh, portraying throughout the team uh, or spreading throughout the team um, it's it's very important to have in the in the change room you know when you know that you can count on six or seven batsmen that are playing for you as a bowling unit also that gives you a lot of confidence so i'm pretty confident of of these guys um, you know in in the coming years and um, as i said you know guys like rahul ajinkya uh vijay has always uh, you know been around for a while they are maturing beautifully and and the more they learn uh, the quicker they learn 
it'll be better for us to to you know be in these kind of winning situations more often.